Hey all of you second channel salamanders, today I am back by popular demand to show you, where is it, this VHSC camera, but also how I'm able to turn tapes into MP4s on my computer. So let's get into it, guys. I'll start out by showing you what you're going to need. Okay, so these are the basic materials that you're going to need. My VHS camcorder is this. I don't know much about it. Basically, yeah, this is the information about mine. So if you want to pause and grab that, go ahead. But we're just going to jump right into it. So the first thing you're going to need, obviously, is your camera. Uh, you can see there's a bunch of controls under here. Don't really need to pay attention to that. All we really need is the zoom in and zoom out function. Uh, of course, recording. You can have it set to camera, power, or play. We also have audio and video out on the back. This is extremely important because we're gonna be needing this to uh, get our video off of here and onto our computer. This is where the battery's supposed to plug in, but um, much like this battery barely lasts more than a couple minutes. So I took a different approach without the battery, um, and I'll go ahead and show you that right now, actually. So this big mess of cords right here is the charger for the camera. So what you would normally do is plug your battery in, it would charge up, you know, the light would go off and then you'd be ready to go. But this battery is old and stupid, so we don't need it. I was lucky enough to get this kind of charger. Now, the way this charger works is that there's two cords coming off of it. The first one is the power cord, doesn't need much explanation. It doesn't come out, it stays in. But this one here does come out and I'll show you, this is what's attached to it. And basically, if you have a keen eye, then you probably notice that it is the same uh, kind of style as this battery. Well, that's because instead of charging up a battery, we can just use this plate directly wired in. So what that allows us to do is get continuous power from the wall into the camera without having to rely on a battery. That's what I mentioned in my one TikTok that I made. Big clunky batteries, uh, YouTube short, whatever. If you don't have this whole kind of charger and you just have the batteries, it'll still work, but you're gonna have to worry about recharging your batteries, so yeah. And then the final piece of this puzzle that we have here today is our HDMI to uh, composite video converter. So basically what this does is it takes Composite input, notice this is input only, this is not input and output. And then out the back we have HDMI out, audio out, and DC in, which this is one of the unfortunate things about working with these uh, kind of converters is that a lot of times they do need to be constantly powered while you're using them. So if we go ahead and hook all this stuff up, I'll show you how it works, ready? Okay, you'll have to pardon the mess, but I'm going to try to explain this as uh, easily and thoroughly as possible. We have the battery pack plugged in, right? We have the battery plugged in. We have the video going out into the video converter, which is charging. Now, what you can do with this video converter is send an HDMI signal out. So this means you could play this on your TV. Um, if you have an old box TV like I do, you could play through these cables, um, just through the actual, just the TV. But yeah, so what I've done here is I've taken an HDMI cable. Now you'll have to bear with me because this is very HDMI cable intensive. So I have this HDMI cable running into this 4K capture card. Now what this does, this was like, I don't know, like 20 bucks online. Basically it takes an HDMI signal in and an HDMI signal out, so you run it, you know, you run your game system into here and into your TV, whatever. You run your camera into here and this into your TV computer, and then it sends a video signal out, winding up the cord and into the computer. Now, let me just show you what you can do with the computer. This is how it's supposed to work, right? Um, so if it's not working this way, then leave a comment and I can help you out. But basically, this is an OBS, by the way. Uh, totally free screen recording software. I don't know why they don't teach you this in school to get it, but if you don't have OBS downloaded, um, the icon looks like this. You should 100% have it by now, um, especially if you're into this kind of stuff. But video capture device, you go in here, um, select OK, and then uh, mirror box capture, that's what this thing's called. And, oh no, blue screen, that's not good. It's because we actually have to turn the camera on, so. As I proceeded to turn my phone off, we got to turn the camera on. Boom. Now? Yeah. So this is my floor. This is the screen. And since it's like going into the screen, it's going to be like infinite tunnel of doom. So yeah, that's only half of it though. So that's just whatever you're seeing in here. So whatever you see in here is coming out up here. If you're having these little like menu, like these words showing up on the actual uh, output, then I would suggest leaving a comment and uh, troubleshooting, maybe look up what particular camera you have. 
So this is a blank tape inside of here. There's nothing on it. Um, when I try to go in, uh-oh, close, dang it. There you go. So if we switch this guy to play, then we can go ahead and see what's on here. Let's see what's actually on this tape. Hello? Oh, it's me. What? It's that VHS camera test. Yo, isn't that awesome? Um, this is probably a big old throwback for you guys. But yeah. So just say I want to take this and put it on my computer. Well, guess what? Since the video output's already going into my computer, it's already taking what's written on the tape and putting it on the computer. So basically all you got to do is just start recording. I don't know where this is going to output to, hopefully to my desktop, but yeah. This is a tape, by the way, like any tape that has anything on it ever. Old home videos, old anything, you can do this with. So pop this guy open, and there you go. That's how you hook up your camera to your TV, your laptop, streaming software, recording software, anything, guys. We're going 2015 YouTube vlog style for the outro, guys. Seriously, um, that's how I set up my camera. Peace. Wow, the whole power in my room just surged when I turned that thing on. Uh, there it is.